Welcome back people, we got some more Fishing Planet for you guys here again today. We are doing some more of the Fish Monster missions. We've done all the missions all across Fishing Planet. If you're interested in any of those, you can check them out. But for here today, we are doing the Neren Skull Bait. So we have to travel to Neren River, which is what I've already done. I'm already here and I've already brought a license. Always remember to buy a license. Otherwise you will get fined and it'd be very expensive. Anytime I do live streams, I always use face camera mic. Anytime I make videos like this, I just randomly hit record. They always turn out to be the best videos I've ever made. So we have to get the skull bait to get the fish monster mission done. As you can see there, I don't really have, well, the missions are complete. I don't really have many left of the fish monster videos left to make. So, but today we are doing Nerin, Nerin skull bait. If there's any other fish monster missions that you need, if you look across the channel, I'm pretty sure they will be there. If not, they will be there soon. I'm going to get all of these all of these fish monster missions done so here we are this is what I'm gonna be using you don't have to use the same setup as me as long as you're using um, the same hook and the same bait and you're casting and fishing in the same place that's really all that matters but anyway I'm using shrimps and I'm using a hash 2 hook on there and then on this one I've got shrimps I'm using a hash 1 hook on there I'm just gonna be using basically different rods but um, pretty much the same setup really so a hash six with the shrimps you can always pause the video at any point if you want to use the same setup as me for the float rods I'm gonna set them up at 29 inches just to mention that Let me um, just quickly take that one up there as well oh, okay, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons oh my gosh wow alright well I will I will get there so I'm fishing down there on the bottom of the map as you can see just there where it's lit up orange my guy that's where we're fishing down there so I'm gonna get set up uh, I'm obviously gonna make a few cuts and edits and stuff into this just to speed it up so it makes your process a little bit quicker so we've got to catch American Shad we've got to catch five of those I've already caught one before and I know where to catch them so this is where we spawn in here we can catch a few here but it's a little bit slow pace so I'm just gonna follow this path around here and I do remember oh okay maybe not there hold on Oh wow, I'm already there. Okay, I was in the right spot. Let me go back. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna spawn at the bottom there, where I did show you where my guy is. So there we are at the bottom. This is where you're spawning right here. I've got a marker set there, but that's not the American Shad. And then is what we're gonna do is we're gonna follow this path around, because over here I caught the American Shad and it was pretty quick. I've had a few over there where I just where that marker was just that you saw just a second ago, but was a little bit of a slow pace so I feel like over here works better this is where we are we're gonna get set up here pretty easy to tell where we are because you'll see these two logs crossing over these bits of rock rocks there I'm just gonna be casting around all around here seems to be like a good idea because that is where I caught it before so this is why I'm here we're gonna make two separate videos I'm gonna do this one as catching the skull bait and then after we're gonna do the um, there would be a fish, once we got the skull bait, there would be a fish monster mission in this lake. Where we then have to catch the monster in this lake. Which I will make a separate video of that. Normally I do put the videos together. But for this one, um, yeah, I just wanted to, I don't know why I wanted to make two videos out of this. I just I just did. I felt like that was the better way to show this one first and then show the other one separate. Anytime I do catch a fish, always keep your eye on the top right at what bait and what hook it is also keep an eye on the time as well because sometimes the time can make a very big difference so yeah keep an eye out for that so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna make a few edits I'm gonna get a fish on and I will bring you guys back when we have American Shad give me a moment and we are back, so catching the American Shed. Just to mention, any time there is updates on Fishing Planet, I download, install as quick as I possibly can, and set up a live stream face cam and mic, showing you guys how and where to catch new unique fish, showing you all the new missions in new lakes as well. As soon as them updates drop, I buy the DLC to get into those new lakes, so we can show you all the great stuff that Fishing Planet has to offer. So if you're interested in Fishing Planet, that's definitely a good reason to subscribe. Turn notifications on so you don't miss out on future updates for Fishing Planet. So here we have American Shad. I'm going to catch a few of these, and then um, we should then eventually get the, the skull bait that we need, and then... Keep an eye out for the next video. Is The next video will be us catching the fish monster using that skull bait. Quite interested to see it because obviously I've never done this mission before. So yeah, it's going to be nice to 
it's going to be nice to see what it looks like. These fish monster missions are pretty cool. If you need to do any other missions, as I said, you can check them out. But we have those all across the channel, as well as other missions, fish monster missions. And any comments that you want to ask, you can always leave it in the comment section below. And I'll try and get back to you guys as quick as possible. Just to mention, I have caught a lot of bass. A lot of bass. Like an insane amount of bass you can catch here as well. So, also a good spot for bass. There's another American Shad. But for the most of it, I think that I caught pretty much all of the um, all of the American Shad. I did catch most of them all on the float rods, I think. I don't think I actually got one on the bottom rod at all. So it looks like the, the float rod's probably the best thing to do here. I will set a marker for most of the, most of it. I've been casting around 65 to 70 foot straight out in front of me. I will set a marker though, just so that way you guys can see exactly where in just a sec. Oh, fish on here. Yeah, a lot of large mouth bass. Good spot for bass. If you want to grind and you, you're a low level here to catch the bass is not bad, so... There we have the American Shad, which now gives us the skull bait. So picking up this one, this one, I will show you that we've completed it, but I just wanted to catch one more American Shad just to show you guys. And also I wanted to set a marker as well. So I have been casting a little bit to the right, just to mention, because it keeps on dragging over to the left. So you probably want to cast over to the, over to the right, then your float eventually will move over to the left and... Yeah, just keep resetting your, your float rod, to be honest. This was the only point where I actually did catch American Shad on a bottom rod. So I did catch it, catch one on the on the bottom rod. But it seems like the float rods do it that little bit quicker. But I'll set a marker for that. Just there in front of me. As you can see, there it is. Which, that is about 70 foot just in front. So, yeah, continuing, showing you that we got this skull bait. We're going to need to pick that rod up because it's going to be loud. There we go. Nerin skull bait mission has been complete. We've now got the skull bait to catch the fish monster. As I said, keep an eye out for that video. It's going to be coming right after this one. I decided to make them as two separate videos rather than putting them together. Just in case you, only, you weren't interested in catching the last fish. But this is a good way to show you where the American Shad are. And insane amount of um, large mouth bass, small mouth bass as well. Skull bait, there we have it. That's what we needed for the fish monster mission. So yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this one. Um, this one actually was pretty quick. Didn't take me that long. So overall, it was pretty good. And then there we have the the monster fish that we then got to catch which will give us some cash and xp which is pretty good so these missions are always worth doing if you're after that little bit more bait coins and cash and xp good way to level up a little bit faster any comments leave it in the comment section below and i try and get back to you guys as quick as possible we catch you people don't forget to drop a like wow forgot yeah drop a like <laughs> we catch you people again soon for some more fun and games i'm out